Hey, ich bin wieder zurück mit Cream Daddy und ähm, heute mal bei Tageslicht aufgenommen. Ich habe keine Ahnung, ob man mich gut sehen kann, weil die Fenster sind da hinten und dann leuchtet es mich halt von der Seite an. Ich habe jetzt aber hier noch die, die Lampe angemacht und ähm, auf dem Testvideo sah es gut aus. Ich habe jetzt hier nur dieses kleine Vorschaubild, aber muss man jetzt mitleben, ne? Fangen wir einfach mal an. So, wir sind gegangen. Jawohl. Ich lese. <laughs> wow, I guess I really didn't think this plan through. I'm not entirely sure where the closest bar is and the man still hasn't shown me how to use the GPS on my phone, so I'm just gonna pick a direction and walk in it. Way to go. <laughs> Let's go. This way. <laughs> cool. Okay. We're marching. We're marching in the direction of the game. Any game, really. <laughs> in the distance. Could it? Be? A big burnt out neon sign hangs above the above tiny dive bar. Jim and Kim's, huh? Alright, it'll do. Yes, we have the bar button. Yes. Alright, come on. The bar is small and dimly lit. The crack of pool ball sounds in the back as patrons laugh and joke. A string of multicolored Christmas lights hover above the bartender. I can't tell if he's Jim or Kim. I pull up a seat at the bar. What will it be? One beer, please. Ah, yeah, ja, ich mag mein Dad. Beer. Sure thing, boss. The bartender slides me an ice cold beer. I take a sip and enjoy the refreshing taste. Ja, so kann man leben, ne? Say, are you Jim or Kim? I'm Neil. <laughs> hey, Neil. Oh. I awkwardly turn my attention to the game which is playing on one of the TVs on the wall. As luck would have it, my team of preference is not only playing, but is currently in the lead, which is always a good thing. The brightly colored mascot, which is some kind of animal, does cartwheels. I silently cheer on my fav favorite, yeah, doch, favorite team, hoping that I don't get into an, any confrontational arguments with a fan of the opposing team. Yeah, man weiß hier nie, was uh, wer da so abhängt, ne? Mal gucken, wen wir treffen. Der Bartender ist es schon mal nicht. Sonst hätten wir ja schon ein Bild von ihm gesehen. Several people in the spa are wearing the distinctive colors of the team I dislike. Although I believe from their de demeanor, demeanor, demeanor that like me, the passion of their team is all in good fun. Ich, ich gebe mir heute echt Mühe. <lacht> A middle-aged woman holding a nearly empty wine glass sidle sidles up to the bar and sits uncomfortably, uncomf uncomfortably close to me. Es tut mir leid, ey. Heute stolper ich irgendwie über jedes zweite Wort. Ich, äh, uh, ja. Konzentration. Okay, wer bist du? Hey, Sailor. Oh, hello. Good to see first. Good to see fresh meat in here. I'm Mary. Come here often. Oh no, I actually just moved to this part of town today. I'm Lloyd, by the way. Ah. Are you watching the game? Ich find's toll, dass es einfach nur the game <laughs> got alles sein. Yeah, my preferred team is in the lead. If they keep this up, they win the game with ease. Hey. Oh, I love that team. And also, I love that game. I love someone who knows their way around balls. Ooh, saucy. <laughs> I'm getting the, the impression that she's a little drunk. She looks a little drunk, yes, indeed. Oh. Ah. Buy a gala drink. Buy a Mary a drink. Don't buy a Mary a drink. Sollen wir sie noch ein bisschen mehr abfüllen? Ja, komm, wir machen das mal. I almost reluctantly signal the bartender and order Mary another glass of wine. Neil jokes back and forth with Mary. They're clearly friends and this clearly isn't her first time doing this. Okay, nichts falsch gemacht. She tips a glass at me. Suppose I gotta keep your company now. So what do you want to know? Moment, du hast mit mir das Gespräch angefangen und ich will was von dir wissen? Um. Okay, what's your deal? What do you think of the game? What's the latest gossip around here? What's your deal? Me? I'm a ghost, Lloyd. I haunt the hallowed halls of Jim and Kim's, waiting for my beloved to return from sea. 
Sie könnte auch aus einer anderen Zeit sein und einfach nur da, äh, ja, feststecken. <lacht> really? No. Ah. Homegirl just laughs a drink. So what else can you tell me about this part of town? Hmm. It's quiet, that's for sure. If you want an I idyllic little life with white picket fence, fences, this is the place to do it. But every town has its secrets, you know? Erinnert mich ein bisschen an Desperate Housewives, die Serie. <laughs> She takes a sip of a drink that was a little too ominous for my taste. She leans closer. Hey. Would you like to learn some of my secrets? <laughs> hey! <laughs> ich müsste die eigentlich auch ein bisschen besoffen besprechen, sie wäre fast noch, fast noch lustiger. Oh boy. Uh, maybe some other time? Rest, Suit yourself, sailor. Mary saunters off, setting her sights on a new spa patron to enter. <laughs> I heavily watch the game over another beer. The game has gotten close in terms of points. A little too close than what I'm comfortable with. After a particular skilled player scores a number of points for the other team, putting them in the lead, I hear an affirmative grunt from another man at the bar. Go team! It's the brooding man from the coffee spoon. He sits alone sipping whiskey and watching the game as well. That tattoo of the hand, that's really cool. Enjoying the game. I am now that we're winning. Oh, we must be rooting for different teams. In my opinion, my team is far superior. I have to disagree with that. Based upon our win-loss record, I'd say that my team is superior. Das ist so witzig, dass sie einfach nur my team, your team, my team, your team. Ah, <laughs> oh, das ist so schön. That's where you're wrong. <coughs> Entschuldigung, that's where you're wrong. Since as it stands right now, my team is beating yours. The conversation ends there and we both go back to sadly rooting for our respective teams. The game is close of both sides playing their hardest to win, but in the end, my team prevails. Quiet cheers ripple throughout the bar. I raise a respectful glass at the man drinking whiskey. He raises his in response. An unspoken truce is formed between us based on mutual love for the game. He motions to the bartender who pours two glasses of whiskey. The man slides one over to me. Name's Robert. Thanks, I'm Lloyd. You must be new here. Mar Mary already hit on you? Yeah. Mm. Robert chuckles. <laughs> oh. She's a peach. Well, you picked the best bar in town. As slimy as it is, you'll never find a better spot than Jim and Kim's. Is there actually Jim or Kim that runs this place? Hey. Nope. That'd be Neil. <laughs> Neil waves from across the bar. Hi! <laughs> hey. Good guy, Neil. Not enough Neils in this world. Yeah, or there wasn't all the, 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 the Neils. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> you whiskey fella or beer fella? Beer, but I'll drink most things. Uh -huh. You like shots? I like shots. I love shots. Oh, shots fired. I don't like him. <laughs> okay, I love shots. Mm. Yay, Hatjen! <laughs> Thank God. Robert nods to Neil, who serves up two shots of whiskey. He hands one to me. Ich meine, das war jetzt auch ein bisschen obvious. Er hat Whisky bestellt und mir quasi auch eingegeben. Es ist irgendwie... Man, 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 man weiß eigentlich, um was es geht. Here's to your health. We take the shots. The whisky burns going down, but I try my hardest to look tough. Wait, I think this is what making friends is. Ooh, friends! Okay, Lloyd, this guy's out of my friend league, but I think if I play my cards right, we'll be pals in no time. Compliment his cool... <laughs> Compliment his cool leather jacket. Compliment his rugged good looks. Compliment his hand tattoo. Das ist mir auch aufgefallen, aber das, damit kann man auch viel falsch machen, je nachdem, was es für Tattoos sind. Äh, uh, Lederjacke. Ich, ich gehe mal mit der Lederjacke. I like your jacket. Thanks. Been in my family a long time. Passed down from firstborn to firstborn. Cursed, some would say. Man, this guy is mysterious and cool. Way cooler than I am, at least. Robert signals to the bartender for another round. What are you doing here tonight? 
My daughter kicked me out of the house, running from my problems, trying to make friends. Ähm... Ist alles gut irgendwie. Uh, trying to make friends. <laughs> I'm new in town, figured it might be good to put myself out here. There. You seem pretty cool. Geht gleich direkt weiter mit den Komplimenten. The key to being cool is acting like you don't care about anything, but actually care very deeply about everything to the point where it's de debilitating. Ich mag den Typen. <laughs> Der hat eine richtig gute Einstellung. Really? Robert downs the rest of his drink. Of course not. <laughs> Aber es ist, es ist was dran, ne? He gets up. I... Be right back. Got a powder on my nose. Never seen Robert this talkative. He must like you. Ha, <laughs> I guess so. I gotta admit that Robert has a gruff charm to him. If a guy like that thinks I'm cool, then I really must be. Robert comes back from the bathroom and grabs his leather jacket. I'm gonna go home. You heading my way? Das ist jetzt richtig krasser Pickup, ne? <laughs> Robert and I leave the bar and, and find ourselves walking in the same direction. So. I live in the in the cul de sac down the way. Cul de sac. Wa wa warum? Was was ist was ist cul de sac? Wer hat sich das ausgedacht? <laughs> Everybody lived there. <laughs> Me too. We just finished unpacking today. Hey. Great place to be. Good neighbors. Well, some of them. Who's that? We get to Robert's house, which is just a few houses away from mine. We stop and he turns to me. Oh. I don't kiss and tell Lloyd. Uh -huh. So are we doing this or what? <laughs> what? Hey. You know, do you want to come inside or not? Was geht denn mit dir? Einfach mal abschleppen, ja, ich gehe in die Bahn und ja, du bist cool, komm mit nach Hause. <lacht> A wave of realization rushes over me. I blush. <lacht> Lay on it smooth. Smile or not? No, thank you. Lay on it smooth, smile or not? Lay on it smooth. Well, I don't see why not. Uh -huh. That sounded smooth in my head. <lacht> Let's do it. I follow him up to his door. He fumbles with his keys for a second and unlocks the door, leading me inside. The moment the door closes behind us, he pushes me up, up against the wall and kisses me, grabbing my hips. Come on. Robert takes my hand and leads me up the stairs and into what I assume is his bedroom. But it's so dark that I can't see anything but Robert's intense expression. Intense. He kisses me again, I can hear him shucking off his jacket, I clumsily taking, take off mine too, his hands roam down my chest and suddenly he's tugging at my belt. I, 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 I don't normally do this. Do you want to stop? Yes, no, no. Ich, ich, bin, ich bin jetzt äh, eager zu sehen, wohin das führt. <lacht> das ist ja eigentlich irgendwie obvious, ne? aber wir, wir gehen mal drauf ein. No. Good. Robert continues to unbuckle my belt and guides me to the bed. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. <laughs> Sunlight streams in between the slats of the blinds. My head is pounding. I really overdid it last night. Wait a minute. This isn't my old house. Or oh, my new house. Wie es da aussieht. Holy shit. Räum mal auf, Junge. Oh, right. I look around for Robert, but find myself alone. Hello? There's a clatter from the bathroom and the door opens. Robert is fully dressed and grabs his keys. That was fun. Yeah, it was. Huh. You should go. <laughs> you should go. Bye. That's certainly not what I was expecting. What hast du denn erwartet, Junge? It's one more I said. <laughs> well, uh, talk to you later. Mm. Robert cracks a smile. Sure, your clothes are over there. Hey. I hastily get dressed and show myself out. The sun is unbearably, unbearably bright. I need to lie down. I start to make my way back home when I suddenly remember... Amanda! Oh my god. Bad Dad. Slap with Robert on the first night. My achievement. Herzlich willkommen bei meinem Stream. Uh, nein, bei meinem Let's Play. 
All right. I rush back home and throw the door open. Something smells delicious. Amanda? Mm. Amanda runs out of the kitchen and looks slightly disappointed. Yeah. Oh man, I was kind of hoping you had gotten kidnapped and I was gonna have to come rescue you. No, I uh, made a friend at the bar last night and ended up sleeping over at his place. Where are the Emmas? Hmm. We left a little while ago. Oh, you guys have fun? Yeah, yeah watch some movies, eat snacks, stole a car, you know, usual sleepover stuff. New teens and you'll... Larceny? Larceny? So, this breakfast that's cooking, what's it all about? Huh? Well, there's hash browns, and eggs, and bacon. Can I? Ugh. Yes, you can have some breakfast. <laughs> Bless you, sweet child. My head throbs. Ooh, I gotta do something about this hangover. Amanda, your loving father might have overdone it last night. Ooh, somebody's hungover. Father of the year. You wouldn't happen to have any aspirin or... Yeah. I've got just the thing. Hang on. Oh. Amanda runs to the fridge and pulls out a jar of pickles. Why? Warum saure Gurke? <laughs> Amanda, what? All right. Drink this. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> the pickle juice? <laughs> That's what I used once. Uh, would assume someone would use. Uh, I would also assume that it works pretty well. Mm. <laughs> Although I never tried it before, and won't try it. Obviously. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Who raised you, Amanda Ann? <laughs> Give her a stern yet resigned side eye. Who raised you? Huh? Um, you did. Right. Um. Do as I say, not as I do. You got it. This better work. I don't a sip of the tart juice. No, no, more than that. Way more than that. Whoa. I mean, I assume. Huh. Watch it, you. I drink more pickle juice and help myself to the delicious breakfast that Amanda has graciously allowed me to partake in. After inhaling some hash browns and dunking several pieces of bacon into runny egg yolk, I'm starting to feel a little better. Na Gott sei Dank hat das geholfen. Amanda grabs her backpack and keys. Well, I gotta get to class. Don't forget the meeting with Mr. Vega, okay? He said it was important. Love ya! Uh, I'll be there. Nugget him dead, kiddo. Yeah. Always do. We do a secret handshake and she's off. I get a little work done at home before I glance at my watch and see that it's almost time for the meeting. I hop in the shower, change clothes and head on my way. Still a little hungover. Woo. Okay. Ich finde, hier kann man äh, dann beim nächsten Mal direkt weitermachen, weil äh, jetzt wir ein Change of Scenery haben. Und äh, ja, dann kann mein Dad auch das mit Robert noch verarbeiten. Weil, Ich glaube nicht, dass er das erwartet hat. Ich weiß, ich hätte Nein sagen können, aber ist... Where's the fun in there? <lacht> okay, ähm, dann sehen wir uns äh, beim nächsten Mal bei Dream Daddy, dem Dead Raptors Cut. Und mal gucken, was in der Schule dann passiert. <lacht> Bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao!